Solanke. Oh, Church, that's great play from Dom Solanke. And then Kelly looks for Solanke again, who tries to take it down. Still got it here, Dom Solanke. Across comes the goalkeeper, Blackman. That is a penalty! Given away by Blackman, the keeper. The challenge came in from a defender as well. And as Solanke went crashing to the ground, Bournemouth have won a penalty for the second game in a row. And junior Stanislas will step forward again. Yeah, I don't think there was any doubt about the penalty. A crucial lead. Here he comes against Jamal Blackman, straight down the middle from Stanislas. He is seven from seven, and it is Rotherham nil, Bournemouth one. Well, doesn't seem to matter how we play at this moment in time. We keep finding a lead, and hopefully we can move on from there. Stadium above the stand on the far side. The building's hard to see. As the ball swung in, and Ladapo has equalised for Rotherham. And there's got to be a big inquest there at the back. Freddy Ladapo, invisible it seemed to the Cherries defenders, swung in low on the edge of the six-yard box, and a crisp blow to his left-hand side. Swung back into the penalty chair once more by Rotherham. Still might break in there. Ladapo looking for room for a shot. Turns away. Round the outside he goes. Floats one back across goal. Oh, Freddy Ladapo with an impudent chip. Not enjoying it today, trailing Rotherham 2-1, but here's Billing driving down the left-hand side of the box is Rico, Rico's cross in towards Dominic Solanke with the header, and it's 2-2! Dom Solanke on the score sheet, wins a penalty, and now scores a goal. Rico immediately with the impact, excellent cross from the left-hand side, and Solanke, despite the goalkeeper's hand, finds the bottom right corner, and the Cherries with almost half an hour to play, back on terms at two each.